Welcome to the Standard Store. Based in the heart of San Francisco, this is a store you've probably never heard of. Well, at least for now. But in just a few years' time, you might just be seeing this technology deployed at your very own local supermarket. And remember, this ain't Amazon Go, but something a little bit different. Standard AI is the brains behind this operation and is rolling out a quick, seamless, and completely automated self-checkout system using the latest in computer vision and machine learning. So how do they actually do it? Well, today, I'm going to see what it's all about. The Standard team have kindly invited me out to their flagship store and test their system and try to break it, if I can. We'll see how this goes. All right, guys, here I am. I've just got my phone ready to go. I think that's all you need. Um, I downloaded the app. I've got an Android phone. I think it's available on both the iPhone, Apple Store and the Play Store for Android. Um, it looks like this. That's the app. And so basically, it's pretty simple. All you have to do is check in. Uh, you've got to have NFC connected. Um, I think that's the most important thing uh, because you're going to have to tap in. But their system is going to be interesting to check out. Uh, so I'm just going to walk through the store, maybe buy a few things here and there, and then we can come back here and take a look at if anything went through, if I bought anything, if there was a false positive or a false negative that got triggered. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'm excited. We'll see how this goes. All right, let's go. Uh, here we go, here's the app, if we can see that, and then hopefully we're going to go in and we're going to see the session, just going to tap and see how this goes. So let's take a look here. So you can actually already see all the, uh, the cameras on the ceiling here. So these are guys that are going to be monitoring all the shoppers that come through. And it's going to be basically tracking whatever you pick up from the shelves. This is actually pretty cool. So let's pick up something very quickly here. I'm going to, I'm going to test it. So I'm going to see if I can pick up some spam. Okay, and then so the back, and then something that I really want to buy now. Probably some stuff, you know? chips, and then I'm probably gonna get a drink as well. So I'm hoping that these guys are gonna pick it up. I'm sort of just meandering my way through the store. Put a drink. Okay. And the water. And then here we go. So as an aside, for those interested in how this works, the cameras mounted on the ceiling are specific computer vision cameras designed to track and monitor all the items on the shelves. So with some clever machine learning, if someone picks up an item, then the cameras will instantly recognize it's been removed or when it's placed back on the shelf. The system tracks the customer based on the NFC tab they use to enter the store and then assigns them a unique identifier inside the system. This way, no matter where you are or what you grab, the item is assigned to you only and no one else. So unfortunately, I didn't grab the best footage of me back in the car, so instead, here's everything that went through. You can see two transactions. I actually went back into the store and grabbed one more item at 305. Then if you go to the second one, you'll see the two items I picked up when I first entered the store. Honestly, it was pretty smooth sailing. The transactions popped up five minutes later and I could continue on with my day. I didn't have to wait in line or take out my wallet once. So what does this mean for the future of retail shopping? Personally, I think it's very exciting. This technology is super disruptive and can potentially upend the retail space. It's all about the scale and if this technology can be migrated seamlessly across geographies and stores of different shapes and sizes, then retail checkout is never going to be the same again. Finally, if you like these videos, don't forget to subscribe and like and let me know what else you want to learn about. Until next time.